want to live in a hole? Do you want to live in a hole? Now here we have a genuine Slab City ruin. You're a Slab City hole dweller now. Bubba Box Truck Curry! Are you guys struggling? Paying a rent? Paying a mortgage? All those utility bills? Do I have the solution for you. Have you thought about living in a hole in Slab City? Yes, a hole in the ground. Step one, find yourself a tree and dig yourself a hole. Now the tree is to provide shade on your hole. Now here we have a genuine Slab City ruin. Someone's old hole house. Now this is the little walkway in. And then you get down inside and you're set. This is, this is basically it guys. Now my suggestion is that you need, you need to dig a little bit deeper than this hole because I think we're like, uh, oh, I don't know, less than three feet deep. So bring your shovel and keep, keep digging. Dig down six feet, eight feet. The deeper you go, the cooler it's going to be for the summer. And, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's a little bit of elbow grease, but hey, think of all the rent you're saving. No more mortgage. You're a slab city hole dweller now. So, uh, you know, think of the upside, the positive. Now, there might be a few things around your hole that worry you, like this, for example. Now, there's a few little animal holes around, you know, like that one, and this one, and this one. But, you know, don't let that worry you. After all, like, how bad can it be? Family of rattlesnakes? You know, you just have to cohabitate. That's all. Not a problem. They're not paying a rent, you're not paying a rent, everyone's happy, right? Now once you have your hole deep enough, you can use some of these tree branches, like this one. And, and a tarp, and you put a little roof on it, and you're set. You just, you know, make a comfy hole. Now over here, you know, under the tree, when it's not too hot, you, you can sit here, enjoy the shade and admire your hole. So, you know, before someone takes this hole, come on over, claim it for yourself. If you need a little more privacy, maybe you're one of them private persons, then, you know, you just wrap a little tarp around the tree, you have yourself a above ground and a below ground house. How cool is that? That's how it's done here in Slab City. It's already feeling like home sweet home here. I've only been sitting in this hole for like five minutes. I don't want to leave. I'm, uh, I'm right at home. You would be too. I'm sure of it. Absolutely sure. In fact, don't even try or run it. Just sell your house. Dig a hole. Start living life. Get rid of the car too while you're at it. You can walk. You know, it's not that hot in the desert. July and August are coming, but you'll be all right. Don't worry. Some people tell me these holes are like mid-70s, the heat of the summer. It's a whole lot better than 120, above ground. Think about it. Really. Are you convinced yet? Come on. No sense of adventure? You don't want to trade your house in yet? Okay. If you ever change your mind, Right here, half dug hole, ready to go. This is like living the dream, guys. Really, Palo Verde tree over there. It's big, it's a sweet one. You don't get a Palo Verde tree like that every day. Lots of empty space behind. This is a nice rural estate. This is the dream, living the dream. No mortgage, no rent. No neighbors, just you and your hole in Slab City. Now, another benefit of this particular hole, of course, is the view. 
Look at that, guys. Chocolate mountains. We'll zoom in. Now, of course, the military base, as far as neighbors go, they are a little bit noisy at times, you know, dropping their bombs and all. But aside from that, this, this hole in the ground does have a, a pretty sweet backyard. Here we have our master hole digger. Dig, dig, dig. If you want to live in a hole in Slab City, this is the way to do it. Get a big ass dog, have the dog dig the hole. Right, Dopey? Right. I'm just putting you to work. I'm renting her out. If anyone needs a hole dug, you can rent Dopey.